Hello everyone, this is Rajun and welcome back to my channel Vocalopi. Today I'm going to talk about a topic that is how to talk about personality types from Word Power Medicine book. In the previous videos, I've already discussed about the session 1 and session 2. In today's video, I'm going to share the session 3. So without further delay, let's begin. Here, in the first, we can see that introvert, extrovert and ambivert. We know it, right? We know what is introvert, extrovert and ambivert. All of these we know. So if your thoughts are constantly turned inward, you are an introvert. Outward, you are an extrovert. And in both directions, equally, you are an ambivert. Okay? The prefix MV means both. It is found in ambidextrous. Ambidextrous. Ambidextrous means able to use both hands with equal skill. Able to use both hands with equal skill. And able to use the right hand and left hands equally very well. Some synonyms for ambidextrous are skillful, expert, extraordinary, etc. The noun form of ambidextrous is ambidextrity. Ambidextrity. Okay. So, the next word is dexterous. It means skillful. Dexterous means skillful. The noun form of dexterous is dexterity. Dexterity. Next is dexter. Dexter. Latin word for right hand in the ambidextrous person, both hands are right hands. Both hands are right hands. Then sinister. The Latin word for the left hand is sinister. So, what is the Latin word for the right hand? Is dexter and the Latin word for the left hand is sinister. This same word in English means threatening, evil or dangerous. Okay, let's come to the book. There may still be some parents who insist on forcing left-handed children to change with various unfortunate results to the child, sometimes stuttering or an inability to read with normal skill. Okay. The French word for the left hand is gauche. The French word for the left hand is gauche. The French word for the right hand is droit. Droit. Adroitness is the opposite of gauchery. Then adroitness is the opposite of gauchery. Because the French word for the left hand is gauche and the French word for the right hand is droit. So adroitness is the opposite of gauchery. Okay. Then. Let's read the book. Misanthrope. Misanthrope, misogynist and misogamist are built on the Greek root misen to hate. We already know that, right? So, the misanthrope hates mankind. The misogynist hates women. And the misogamist hates marriage. Okay? Miso simply means to hate. Now, anthropos. Anthropos. It means mankind. Anthropos means mankind, human mankind, anthropology, the study of the development of the human race, of the human mankind, anthropology, the study of the development of the human mankind or human race. Philanthropist, philanthropist, one who loves mankind, one who loves mankind, philanthropist. Okay, then the root gyne, woman, woman. The root gyne, woman, is also found in gynecologist. Gynecologist means the medical specialist who treats female disorders mainly. Gynecologist. Okay. Now, the root gamus. Gamus means, simply means marriage. Gamus means marriage. Monogamy. Mono means one. Monogamy. One marriage. Bigamy. Two marriages without divorcing the previous wife. Two marriages without divorcing the previous wife unlawful act of contracting another marriage without divorcing one's current legal spouse. Okay? Yes. Bigamy, two marriages without divorcing the previous wife. Monogamy, one marriage. What about polygamy? Right? Polygamy, many marriage. Poly means many. Marriage, gammy means marriage. Poly means many. Okay? Polygyny, many women. Polygyny, many women. So, monogamy, 
is the custom of only one marriage at a time bigamy is two marriages you know in actuality the unlawful act of contracting another marriage without divorcing the one's current legal spouse polygamy many marriages okay many marriages polygamy uh, many women many women okay so polygamy simply means like uh, two or more marriages for male for male yes polygamy okay and polyandry polyandry two or more marriages for female two or more marriages for female so what if a woman has two or more husbands a form of marriage practiced in the himalaya mountains of tibet the custom is called polyandry polyandry two or more marriages for female okay next number 3 is like uh, making friends with suffix person practice etc and adjective misanthrope or misanthropist practice misanthropy practice means mainly this you know studies adjective form misanthropic misogynist misogyny misogynous or misogynistic gynecologist the practice the study mainly gynecology adjective form gynecological monogamist the practice form is monogamy adjective form would be monogamous bigamist practice bigamy adjective bigamous polygamist practice form polygamy and adjective would be polygamous polygynist practice polygyny adjective polygynous polyandrist practice polyandry adjective polyandrous philanthropist practice or the studies form is philanthropy and the adjective form is philanthropic philanthropic anthropologist the person anthropologist who studies mainly what anthropology but the subject anthropology and the adjective form would be anthropological next the next word is ascetic 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 means monk or hermit monk or hermit okay so let's summarize the first new word here in this session number 3 is ambidextrous able to use both hands with equal skill equally okay next dexterous skillful dexter dexter is the latin word for right hand in the ambidextrous person both hands are right hands sinister latin word for left hand sinister the french word for the left hand is gauche the french word for the right hand is droid adroitness is the opposite of gaucherie then anthropos mankind anthropology the study of the development of the human race the study of the development of the human race philanthropist one who loves mankind once one who loves mankind gynae gynae simply means woman gamas means marriage gynae gynecologist the subject mainly okay gynecology the subject gynecologist the medical specialist who treats women disorders gamas means marriage monogamy one marriage bigamy two marriages without divorcing the previous wife unlawful act of contracting another marriage without divorcing one's current legal spouse polygamy many marriages poly means many gamy means marriage polygamy many marriages two or more marriages for male polygyny many women polygyny many women polyandry two or more marriages for female okay then the last word is ascetic ascetic means monk or hermit monk or hermit so that's it for today's video thanks for watching bye and take care